but they ran out of the I saw one for sixty dollars but they ran out well Black Friday you've got to get in there early before everything's gone not that I've ever been to a Black Friday sale good morning ship breaker links would like to share the following message the only peas permitted in the salvage yard are profit, processor, and potassium trifluoromethane sulfonate. Mm hmm Okay, what have we got? We'll do this one. Patient missing. Oh yeah, of course, because they, they, they took away the thing that I was building that I didn't know anything about. You were the Black Friday. Literally nothing happens here. I don't go outside on the best of days, so... Like if this Black Friday's happening, I'll, I'll miss it. I always do. I miss everything. Because I'm indoors. Playing video games. Watching other people play video games. Or doing something completely unrelated. Indoors. I don't go outside. I should, but I don't. I'm just wondering what we have to work with without blowing anything up this time. Looks like a cargo ship. It's the back end like that's a Okay, I think we have to do that for the inside, otherwise things are gonna get messy. Where is the inside? Is that it? That is it. The issue with bread makers I found is that you can smell the bread as it bakes and that makes you want to eat the bread. <laughs> ah I got a nice digital camera for my pain YouTube, that's really good. Freshly baked bread is like the nicest thing. I need to actually get back into baking bread because I can't be fucked with cakes anymore because I just don't have quite as much of a sweet tooth as I used to. It's also just a bloody faff. And I don't want to eat more fucking cake. Bread is nice. Why is this broken? I didn't break it this time. Is that a thing I can get? It is cool. A lot of food. Scrap. Flickering lights. That's like not hugely encouraging, I have to say. What is this? Is that a thing I can pick up now? Forklift, okay. Well, that's not meant to be out like that. These are the switches I have to pull before I can open anything because it'll blow up otherwise. Well, I can get that. My eyes hurt from staring at this screen. Ugh. The thing is, I like my teeth more. I also like my skin more. I like my general health more. I think it's something that if you had like a shitty time with health in general growing up and you've got a bunch of allergies, you just sort of value your general health a bit more. I mean, I watched my brother basically disintegrate from eating too much sugar. Like he had literal holes in his skin so yeah, sugar and me, not exactly the best of friends. Air pressure level increasing. Oh, well, that's not what I meant. Air pressure level decreasing. I want it to decrease fucking, wait, it's already open, isn't it? What am I on about? Oh, I don't know. I have so many fake teeth. Oh, I have many pulled teeth. I mean, I broke one of my back teeth on a piece of unpopped popcorn. It was already dead, so it's not like it was a huge loss. I had his teeth here pulled. I'm probably going to get this one down here, Paul, because it's just, I can't even chew on it. It just hurts. Is that Tom Selleck? 
Don't think my moustache is big enough. Right, I want to get in there. Okay, so this is probably going to suck. Yep. Can I do a thing with this? No, this isn't even the room I meant to go in. Sounds about right. I'm trying to get to not here. I think back here. Okay, so this may go horribly wrong. I think the juice of it is, is that I do want to be healthy and I don't mind eating healthy food so long as it tastes nice, which it can. Also, I need to play more games I'm actually, like, that are actually, like, my strong suit, because I'm trying to think what is it. Puzzle games are not. Crafting games are not. Bloody hell, stream elements. Calm down. Okay. I'm going to start opening this place. Cracking it open. Something or other. Words, words, words. Yep. <clears throat> well, it's the thing is, it is a fucking myth that vegetables and fruit are good for you. What is good for you is a balanced diet. In other words, a bit of everything. If you're just eating vegetables, you are just fucking up your insides. And as my older brother keeps saying, there is a reason cows have three stomachs. Some foods help digestion, some foods slow it the fuck down or just clog it right up. And honestly, vegetables clog it the fuck up. Cows have three stomachs. Well, they definitely have more than one. Jeez, I'm going to be pissed if my brother's just making shit up. How many stomachs does a cow have? <laughs> I'm Googling it. I don't even care. How many stomachs does a cow have? Someone's already looked it up. Four! Wait, room in the stomachs have four compartments. Yeah, okay. It has four stomachs. And then it goes a special digestive process to break down the tough and coarse food it eats. When the cow first eats, it chews the food just enough to swallow it. The unchewed food travels to the first two stomachs, the rumen and the reticulum, where it is stored until later. Yeah, four. I thought three. I was wrong. It's four. Interesting. How do I break this place open? Four stomach aches. Well, not if they're eating their food well. It's gonna get a bit crowded in here. you got to have more protein than carbs and vegetables are carbs I actually did not know this for the longest time I thought fruit and veg was protein it's not it's carbohydrate how do I get out of here again this place is a bloody rabbit warren how the hell do I get out of here okay my dad used to make stomach soup and I hated it. What the hell? What does that even mean? I mean, I know you can have like 
a is it like a Scottish dish that's like literally like a sheep stomach stuff with shit? Can't remember what it's called. It's soup out of stomach. Like what the fuck? Hi, I guess that's the thing. Yes, yes, we like that, but Arab. But the thing is, it doesn't even matter like what you're eating. If it tastes good and if it's healthy, who the fuck cares in a way what part of the whatever it comes from? I mean, I will say there is definitely like giggles and a few gags to be had eating any animal sasties. Most foods just stop being a baby and just fucking eat it. If it tastes good, who cares? If it's good for you, who cares? I'm about to cancel one. Apparently so. You're not gonna get any. Fuck off. Right? Bake bread, get some chicken, roll it in the breadcrumbs, bake it. There's your chicken nuggets. Healthy. McDonald's is a fucking farce and it's gross. Like most fast food joints are a fucking farce. When I used to live someone who was a lactose intolerant, but he would eat cheese anyway because he liked the way it tasted and then he would complain to the fucking moon about how he felt sick afterwards. Like, I'm sorry, but fuck you. Like, if that's your standpoint, like, I want to eat the thing even if it makes me sick. That's a fuck off. Get lost. You have no sympathy from me if that's your take. There are perfectly healthy and tasty alternatives to things that are making you sick, you fucking idiot. Like, I'm pretty tolerant of most bullshit, but if I get somebody like that, like, fuck off. Like, don't even talk to me. doing well at not blowing any of this up. Although I imagine that will soon change. We shall see. I've seen someone eat a worm which is the opposite side of the spectrum. Nothing wrong with worms. I mean you do realize that insects are some of the most nutritious things on the planet, right? Crickets? Like, if it's good for you, like, if it's not gonna kill you, fine. If it's not gonna make you sick, fine. I try worms. I wanna try frog's legs, I wanna try snails. I'm up for a bit of everything. If I can tolerate it. Which, for cow's milk, and for wheat, I can. And that's that. Oh, woe is me, I've done this to myself, no, not the constant consequence. That was basically what it was like, and he would constantly block our toilet. Constantly block our toilet. That's one minute left on the clock, Cutter. Piece of shit. One minute left. Oh, geez, I'm doing my lives. Well, there's a di well, farting is actually like a natural process. If it's like 
excessive, then that's a problem. If it's giving you a stomach ache, that's a problem. If it's giving you constipation or diarrhea, that's a problem. I mean, I fart a lot when I eat eggs. I can still eat eggs. I think everybody farts a lot when they eat eggs. What the fuck am I doing in here? cheese has a single effect on me which is really nice I don't know why I'm being bothered writing myself it's literally over oh haha <laughs> my fucking neck what time are we on ow You're a cute boy. Ew. Jeez, I don't even think stretching is helping. Mm. Okay, I pressed a button. I pressed a button. I'm trying to show you my cat. Oh. I'm an idiot. I was pressing one on the keyboard. Dash 52. Your designated sleep period is now over. Have a great day. Do you want up? Do you want up? Do you want a cuddle? Do you want a cuddle? He does not look bothered at all. <laughs> Do you want a cuddle? He was here earlier, hanging out. Ouch. Okay. I got a poster. I also got an email I'm not going to read. You're getting so big. It's so big. <laughs> yeah? What are, you, what are you screaming about, huh? Do you wanna... Do you wanna come up? Come on. You're just sitting there crying at me. Come on. Honey, you know how to get up here. I've done it a thousand times. Easy. Toby, come on. What's up? Yeah. Like you're saying, it's hurting your eyes at the PC and not reading emails and being micromanaged and stretching isn't helping. Yeah. Did your old job also involve a cat just meowing in your ear? Here, huh? Come for a cuddle. Cuddle? I know you know the word cuddle. Yeah, you do. He knows the word cuddle. It's a it's jazz from the simulator. Ah. Okay. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. That's my sweet boy. You okay, sweet boy? He's my sweet boy. <laughs> uh, uh. Hmm. I would get seven million emails a day and nine and ten of them were important but flagged for phishing. Oh, jeez. Doesn't every job include a cat meowing in there, or is that my auditory hallucinations kicking in again? I think it might be a bit of both. Oh, sweetheart. Sweetheart. There you go. 
got his got his poor caught between my earphones. <laughs> Sweet boy. We had an office dog. Oh, he does sound cute. And one of my earliest jobs was at a historical society and my boss would bring her puppy in. It was a golden Labrador, I think, or a golden retriever. His name was Enzo. He was so sweet. Okay, you can stop flopping around. That was a, a long time ago. Right. Right, we're gonna cancel these, send that down there. That down there. That down there. The dog for every office key key for president 2024. Yep. I'd vote for you if I was American in any conceivable way, other than my accent, sometimes. Okay, and you guys. That's two votes. <laughs> Pressing all the wrong buttons. Yeah. Oof. Now I need like a, a few more. No, 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 no. Come back here. That way. Don't get fucking lost in space. Jeez. Excuse me? Will you just fucking go in the thing? Why is that so hard for you to comprehend? I fucking cancel both of those tellers and go fucking in there manually. By manually, I mean that gravity did the job. Do you vote for the US government with discount? But that's a minor detail. Okay. There's a lot of stuff in here. I don't like it. Cute boy. So what does that actually do? Nothing seems to be free. Bloody hell, boy! Stop breathing in my face. You have such bad breath. Like damn. He's so little and cute, though. I should run for that. So you see what we incentivize sketch and cross you. I did not. I haven't been on Twitch much lately, it's just under the time and the energy. <sighs> but do tell, I'd like to know. I miss like hanging out on Twitch for this. It is ridiculous just how tired I am. And I know I've been complaining about being tired pretty much since I started streaming, but and I mean just started actually streaming for the first time ever. But it does seem to be getting worse. with 
cutting anything too close to this bloody thing. So such fear can conscience vault. Yeah, I think I need some background too. You're right, Kit Kat. What's up? What's up, my sweet boy? Question for you, Kiki. Is your diet wheat free or gluten free? Because there is a difference. Well, allow me to apologize in advance for completely uh, ruining your day. Beer has gluten in it. Yeah, yeah, I haven't been drinking beer a lot, but is it okay? Yes, Kit Kat? I, ne I have the advantage of never really liking beer. Oh, fuck. Keep forgetting that space bar is not fucking break. After December, I am going dry at least until my birthday. It's four months. And honestly, kind of looking forward to it. I was honestly kind of sick of getting drunk. More particularly, kind of sick of getting drunk by myself because I'm too fucking tired to ever go out and actually get drunk with another person. I'm tired. Alright, Gunner. You got five minutes left in this ship before they turn the lights out. Little Misfits ones have included variations, uh, with the current iteration being Guinness and Pipeline Punch Monster. Halfway through the stream, they did half. Oof. But that does not sound like a good combo. Like, no matter how you're looking at it. My experience, beer doesn't really mix well with much of anything. Except, I don't know, more beer. Even then. Recommended. Not a huge fan of these enclosed spaces. That's what you sound like. You sound like an old man. And sometimes you sound like a baby because you got that sweet little don't yawn in my mouth. The monstrosity about to get sound like a New Jersey. <laughs> Good event stream. Okay, I'll, I'll give that a look in a bit. Spaces. I apologize to anyone with the claustrophobia, including myself. I was about to tell when I was younger and I've seen some stuff, but never that. Damn. No, it's after a pineapple piece, I'm actually covered in pineapple. Ugh. Well, I can't eat pineapple either, so I guess go me. Can't eat pineapple or beer. And not that you eat beer, unless it's like really stale. Uh, 
Okay. Okay, finally some fresh air. Let's get out of here. Let me out. Mm. Okay, I'm too hot now. You go in your bed when I take this blanket off. Fuck. Sorry, sweetheart. Oh. Mostly, my experience with drinking is just wine, like copious amounts of wine. Not really much for experimentation with alcohol. We had a drink where we would just pour the bomb out into a sh Oh, a sweet mother of- Don't do that. That's disgusting. Oh, there's so many levels of gross I can't even begin to- Thanks, dude. Object accepted for processing. It was the worst I've seen. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, this place is basically disintegrating, but disintegrating in a way I wanted it to. Kind of. Boost. Check my latest uh, photography uh, post in Discord if you're curious of what these look like. I will give it a look after the stream, I think. I just can't be bothered alt tapping right now. <laughs> Being real lazy. Just real lazy. And sore. Fuck me. It was always the young single guys that would complain when they didn't want them. It's real. That just sounds like men anyway. That's a bit of a generalization, but I don't know. Skip. 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 I don't care. You might have seen what looked like your run of the mill junk mail. I didn't look. Just talking about that email. And I'm sorry I cut you off, Lena. Sorry. Processor deposit accepted. Credits awarded. Yeah, we ain't playing this in the story, in case you were curious. The story is happening, it is there. And when the story is over, I will stop playing, but it's not what I'm here for. Uh, a mostly reasonable generalization. Bartending you learn about folks. Yeah, I can imagine. Thought about working in a bar once. And then I remember how tired I get doing my dishes, so yeah. And having to wait on that many people, and they're bitchy as well. Oops. Hello. Obviously, like, not all of them are bitchy, but enough of them. It's like, well, why will never work in retail? I'm a bit worried about what will happen if I pull this off, but let's do it anyway. Well, the game paused. <laughs> it stalled briefly. Okay, would you get over here, please? And just get your electrocuty butt in the barge. Processing valuable object. Like, be gone. Bye. Salvage deposit confirmed. 
Well, it's funny how many people behave exactly how you'd imagine when they order particular drinks. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I've never been, like, one who habitually goes to the pub or anything like that. So I don't really know an awful lot about, like, bar and pub culture. It's just not something I know about. I know enough about people to know I don't want anything to do with them. But that's about as far as that goes. Or at least most of them. There's something about people that's just fucking depressing, you know? funny to overhear conversations yeah well that was something else i actually forgot to mention that happened when i went away with my friend that day back in october i was knackered so we actually went back to the ferry tram a lot early we were still on a bench like around the corner from the main desk and this woman came in and she was like really really rude to like the person in front of her or like near her we couldn't actually see we weren't gonna look but she was just like, oh, excuse me, I'm next. And then it became increasingly obvious that she was blind fucking drunk. And from what the staff had said is that she was actually escorted off the ferry the previous day for being drunk and disorderly and being fucking rude to everybody. And that they were kept saying you're not allowed back on the ferry after that. Also, you're blind drunk again so there's definitely no way we are letting you on the ferry <laughs> like that is something that happened that we, I, we overheard that conversation and it was just like kind of fucking awkward <laughs> she kept saying oh i'll just go and sit somewhere for an hour i'll be better then no no that's that's not how being drunk works of like damn I never want to be like that drunk in public, ever. I mean, I don't even like going out on a Friday night because the last time I went, it got like really rowdy and people were like chucking beer bottles around and they were just breaking all over the place. And it was just like, I don't really want to make a habit of being in that kind of place, you know? That kind of scenario. It was just threatening. I didn't like it. So yeah, I stay in and drink with friends when I have friends to drink with. As rare as that occurrence is. Yeah, I just don't really like being around large groups of people who I know nothing about. And this other thing about pubs is they get fucking noisy. You have to yell over everybody to be heard and you still cannot hear anything. I hate that. It's like... There's nothing about regular pub culture that, like really tickles me. Like I went for my sister's birthday and that was great and I made some good friends doing it. But not something I'd make a habit of doing. No way.
We don't throw things much, has to be the right vibe. Yeah. Maybe it's just like British pub culture that throws stuff. Like I feel like bars in America, at least some of them are anyway, are like classy joints. At least some of them. But I mean, well, we have classy joints here too, but it's like the pubs and the taverns or whatever the fuck you call the the rowdy ones. Because no pub isn't really like a term America uses, Americans use. What am I doing? Why am I why am I the wrong way up? Hey Kit Kat. You alright? When did you get so cute? The answer is the day you were born. He's really cute. Hey Candle, how you doing? We're just looking at my cat because he's very cute. Mm -hmm. Will you boop? Oh, yes. Since your range of place spell, all the fan spots are taken over. That's good. Processor deposit accepted. Mm -hmm. Credits awarded. And I keep forgetting to pause the game when I do that because it's on a fucking timer. When I have oxygen that's depleting, I might suffocate from petting a cat. You okay? Oh, I know what he wants. Are you hungry? Do you want some food? <laughs> and that settles that. I'll be back shortly. I won't even bother muting it, I'll just be two ticks. No, oh, come on, Kit Kat. Come on. Well, I have an alarm set, so he knows. That's why he was actually probably on my desk. It is because <laughs> he was like, Mom, Mom, it's, it's, it's dinner time. And I was like, what? Oh. <laughs> and I honestly think that's all we're going to do for today. My back is fucking killing me. And <sighs> These are new glasses, which remember I broke my last pair. I put the picture in Discord, so... And they said, well, you can get the new frames ordered, but it'll take about six to eight weeks. So it would be quicker if you just picked out a new frame. So yeah, I'm happy with them. They're weird. I like the weird ones. Also, the first pair of glasses I've ever got that aren't purple. I don't know. It just became a trend that I would always get purple glasses. Hey, I think we're going to end there. I'll put some background music on for y'all. And then. Okay, so something I want to start doing now and for every stream is let you guys pick who we raid. I want to raid like familiar people, different people, people I might not know, things like that. As long as you guys vouch for them, I'd be happy to raid them. Yeah, thank you everybody for hanging out. I know it was a bit all over the place, but then some of my streams do tend to be that way and that's just kind of our vibe. So yeah, we've got a few people live right now on my end, but I'd be up for just about anybody. <laughs> it's one minute past feeding time, Mum. Meh. Accurate. Accurate. So sorry you came in just at the end there, Candle, but it was uh, lovely to see you. Okay? Can you give your suggestions? Don't worry about it. Yes, I'm trying to limit my streams to, well, I say limit, like two hours would be the goal. If we end up going longer, it's fine. It's just that because my back's messing up after doing that art stream the other day. My posture's just kind of not recovered yet. Uh, I, uh, you have a variety stream that you might appreciate then. Do let me, uh, well, just drop the handle in chat and I'll check them out. Hawk, hawk shock, 
Hawk Shock. What's she doing, Hawk Shock? <sighs> Not a huge fan of all guys, but I'm open to new people. Absolutely. Also, something I wasn't even gonna like publicize this, but the way my energy levels are right now, it is entirely likely that I won't actually be able to spend almost any time on Twitch hanging out with other streamers unless I am raiding them because that's just how my energy is just fucking with me right now. But hopefully that will change when my chronic fatigue gets more manageable. Right now, I'm just gonna hang out with people after I raid them and for as long as I can. I'll follow them all, so if ever I wanna go back, I will. But I'm just, I just, unfortunately, cannot prioritize hanging out with people's streams right now, which is sad, but it is what it is. But yeah. Decent streamer does Lego builds. That's really cool. There's a variety of games as well. Sounds like fun. We will read them. But yeah, thank you everybody for hanging out tonight. It's been an absolute pleasure. Legos are indeed great. And I will see you all on Tuesday for something or other. Maybe what remains of Edith Finch then, because last week it's been a bit, well, you know, all over the place. That's our thing, along with being premium content. Or even. Bebemium. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll say goodbye before I just talk, keep talking like the little engine that could. I wouldn't put it past me. Bye, everybody. How do buttons work again? Remind me. I forget. No, that's the wrong one. There we go. Cat can. The cat is eating. Exactly. What do they do? Oh, I haven't muted myself yet, so I'll say this. One art stream. I'm gonna make the buttons, what do they do, design for the t-shirt that we will eventually sell as merch. That is something I would love to do. And until next time, bye! Buttons, what the fuck am I doing? Bye!